Apart from being excuses for the local beat addicts to get a little airing without being too far from their favorite sounds, these trips are aboard the Royal Iris serve to get us across here to New Brighton, which is just up from Birkenhead and Wallasey. What's over there? Well, there's amusement over there, and candy floss and toffee, and as if Liverpudlians didn't get enough of it on the Lancashire side of the Mersey, there's humanity. Others of their own species by the job lot. And down among the seasiders, as well as the donkeys, which are fixtures on the New Brighton beach, today there's a very special attraction. There's Tiffany. And when you try to change the subject, does it make him mad? Does he say he's only being curious and make out less it by making furious? Yeah, some things are better left unsaid. To confess the skull There just might not have been any And then again there might have been many Yeah, some things are better left unsaid Take it from me, some things are better left unsaid Tiffany would be hard to leave on any beach, but the Royal Iris has a date to keep in Liverpool. If you look across the river, you will see the Liver Building, the landmark that is Liverpool. On its twin steeples are perched two gigantic liver birds. They're mythical, and they look something like pelicans with bad dispositions. Somehow they've managed to make a name for themselves in Merseyside folklore. And the local belief is that Liverpool took its name from the liver birds. That means that it's time for the Royal Iris to be heading back for town.